up that makes you girl joy you know what i'm gonna say and i'm back <laughs> i'm back in the house like a hard deck okay <laughs> too much well i just got back from the grocery store and i'm trying y'all i'm trying the girls got me out of bed today so that was a big help Oh, that ponytail was pulling on these braids. I need to redo the front of these braids. So anyway, focus short. Focus. I hope you guys are doing well. So I went to the grocery store and bought a bunch of veggies. Trying to eat better. It's just like I get home, I don't feel like cooking. And Sydney will meal prep. But it's stuff that she likes and whatever. And then I want to use the juicer. And I was doing some research on a the juicer. There's different types of juicers. There are juices where the shelf life of your juice can last anywhere from 24 hours to 72 hours depending on the juicer. One type is centrifugal or something like that and the other one starts with an M. And then I, I couldn't wait to get home to see what kind Bay Daddy bought me so I, I don't know, it doesn't, it doesn't have those words on it so I don't know what I have. I'm gonna dig a little deeper. So, let me show you what I got from the grocery store. I got another bag of carrots. It's like every week, my goal is to juice. <laughs> and I never get around to doing it. So, I got some carrots, celery, cucumber, and this is the juice. Then I got some beets, jalapenos, I like a little heat in my juice. Spinach, parsley. I saw a recipe where you gotta add parsley. You gotta have your ginger. And with the peppers right here, I'm going to attempt to make two types of sandwiches with the peppers, where the pepper becomes your bread. I wanna try it. So I'm gonna try egg salad, and then I'm gonna try a chicken salad. And then I'm gonna try turkey lunch meat. So I'm gonna try with hummus. And peppers, I like to nibble, we all love to nibble on these peppers. Um, I got some kale, oops, some kale for the juice. Um, as asparagus, we love asparagus. Do you know when you eat a lot of asparagus, it comes out in your urine? Just a few tomatoes. We like tomatoes, but we don't love them. But we enjoy tomatoes, so I don't want to get too many. Some Brussels sprouts. We love Brussels sprouts. And I was looking and got some broccoli. I was out of my favorite creamer, so I haven't had coffee in a couple of days, so I got this creamer. Then I bought some potatoes, because I was watching this guy and he made a dish with some meatballs and potatoes and broccoli. It looked good. And then I was kind of feeling like a salad. I went to the grocery store hungry. That's what I did. Um, got some 1% milk. I'm going to make some cabbage. Okay, wait. Let me, let me not skip over stuff. Then I got eggs. I bought extra eggs to make the egg salad. So we all like egg salad. Then the kimchi... At Walmart, this is a different brand, so I hope I like this kind. And I have these, I use this for my grits. Yes, once in a blue moon, I have to have me some grits, honey. Okay, and I use that kind of cheese for my grits. I got some um, cheddar cheese, and I'm going to do something with this. I'm gonna put that in the air fryer, honey. I'm gonna show you how it turns out. And I've never bought turkey before, I always get ham, so I'm trying to transition to turkey, and I wasn't going to the deli, so I got that. And the way I make my meatballs, I like to use a sweet Italian sausage, but this one is hot Italian sausage, and some ground turkey. That's how I make my meatballs, smother them some gravy, baby! <laughs> and then I got cabbage. I got this cabbage and red cabbage. I'm gonna make me some cabbage and I'm gonna use this smoked turkey leg to add to my cabbage dish. And I got this stuff over here to make smoothies. Girls love making smoothies in the morning. So I got some fruit 
and they love 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 these sweet potato fries this particular brand so I picked that up and this is for me for later this is an apple juice and I like to turn it into you know adult soda stuff so don't worry don't worry about that, worry about that. and this is just to try to organize the pantry so I just got two little containers but this right here I found these bottles because if I'm gonna juice I'm just gonna juice a whole bunch and Sydney has been asking me to juice so I bought these these were at Walmart for a dollar so I figured I could fill these up um, with the juice I got six to see how we like them and it says don't put them in a the dishwasher hand wash only for cold drinks only so I thought they were cute for a dollar I really wanted glass bottles but I couldn't find them and Bay Daddy said they got me some pans but I did see this the girls sometimes they love they my kids eat hot breakfast and this is like the little pan. We have a little pan, but it's really, really little. So this is really for the girls and their quick eggs in the morning. Once in a balloon, I like to do some eggs. So this all looks good so it doesn't stick to the pan. So this really, I bought that for them. And that is my little haul. Oh, let me show you this. So in my head, I was gonna get going and paint and paint the um my little thing in the garage so i was like just keep going so i said just to get you a little energy drink just to pull through but so as i was checking out i picked this one up because i wanted to try it and this is dragon fruit i know a lot of people not into energy drinks but once in the moon I, I like them and this is dragon fruit baby i said bobby taste so i opened it when i got home i said bobby bobby just try it just you know a little sip whatever I go upstairs, twirl around, come back, gone. Gone. And she was like, that was good, man. That's the best one I've ever tasted. I said, exactly. I, I didn't buy this for you. Purr. She was like, man, that was good. I'll get you another one. So, <laughs> and then I saw this deodorant. <coughs> I bought me some um, cough drops. So, I saw this deodorant. I don't wear, I typically don't wear much deodorant. But, I want to have deodorant when I want it. And Sydney robbed me of my deodorant. She was like, Ma, you don't wear deodorant. And this one was a little pricey. Um, it's um, paraben free and aluminum free. So, I just wanted to try it um, to see how it worked. Now, if I'm exercising, I will throw on some deodorant, but just like day to day stuff. And in the summertime, I may put it on two, two, three times a week, maybe, maybe if that, but definitely if I'm exercising, I will throw boop, boop, just a little dot <laughs> and it's fine. So I want to try this native brand and see how that, um, works. And then I bought the girls um, a Tom's deodorant. So that is my haul. Um, I need to get the cold stuff in the fridge. I need to eat something. It is now 2.30 and I haven't eaten anything. I don't have an appetite in the morning at all. So I just had water, went for the walk with the girls and that was about it. So I'm boiling some eggs now to see how that pepper, the thing tastes with the pepper, I don't know. So maybe I could do the egg salad the egg salad, tomato, and uh, a slice of the turkey and see how that tastes. And then I'm gonna whip up some chicken salad. We love the chicken. I make mean, good, good. I don't do nothing but add some mayo. Gotta have all y'all can't have it without my onion. Uh, uh. Onion and relish, sweet relish, salt and pepper. That's all I do. I'll be doing nothing extra, extra, extra. But I am excited to try the um, pepper sandwich. I will let you know how that turns out. Maybe I'll create that in another video, but I'm about to throw this papaya up in there, honey. The papaya and see how that turns out in the air fryer. Come here, come here, come here. I'm going to try it in the air fryer and see if it's good. That's what it is. Come, 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 come here, come here, come here. Let me tell you. So what happened? I went there so hungry. I'm not really hungry, but I know it's that time to eat. So mentally, and then I want to do the juice. <sighs> One thing at a time, one thing at a time, okay? Oh, and then I bought toilet paper and paper towels. So, 
now that that thing is painted now i gotta see about getting the treadmill getting those screws and they just won't go in i just can't shove the thing so it could go straight in I, I don't know so i have to loosen up everything to see if it'll work all right let me get the frozen stuff back in the freezer and make me something it's just like i want to eat everything right now <laughs> i want the turkey sandwich the chicken salad the egg salad the pot pie the this the meatballs and everything <laughs> the juice but i can't wait to try the juice up, but I have to figure out what type of juicer it is. Let me look it up, cause I was researching. Hold on, calm down, calm down, hold on. Okay, it's between a centrifugal, centrifugal, or a masticating juicer. Centrifugal versus masticating. So if you're interested in getting a good quality juicer, you want to get a masticating juicer. It's a little slower and you're gonna, and it increases the shelf life of your juice. So I don't know what I have, but it was what I asked for. But I wasn't thinking about all that. I'm just like, and everything that I've researched, it just like, you gotta drink that juice right then and there. But if it can last a day or two, I'll draw my toe. I may have to upgrade my juicer later. Later. So the shelf life can be if you're going to spend all this time juicing, you want it to last. You know, if you're just doing a big batch, you, you're taking a day, you're going to juice. So you can have juice for the next two, three days. You know, so you, I want to think about it like that too as an investment. All right, but let me see what kind I have. All right, y'all, I'll check in with you later. So... Give this video a thumbs up or not, because you're going to do what you want to do anyway, period, period. <laughs> okay. Bye, y'all. All right, y'all. I was trying to clean out the refrigerator a little bit.